hello everyone i hope you enjoy our photo video at animal kingdom subscribe for more videos at jay's case world Thank <laughs> you. 
to go on in. The first stop on our journey is going to be the Little Literary Forest. Animals here use natural camouflage to hide from their predators. Let's see if we can find any today. Oh, we got quite a few here. On the left-hand side, we have bongos up on the hill. Those are those antelope. And on the right-hand side, we have a big one. A big one. You might think that okapi is related to the zebra due to the stripes on their hind legs. But it's actually more related to the giraffe. <laughs> the bongo is also known as the ghost of the forest, as it is so rarely seen. Both males and females have those heavy horns that lean backwards. That helps them to get through the bushes without getting stuck. Oh my god! Right in the left, on the, in the water here to our left, we have a black rhino. <laughs> <laughs> These guys weigh about 3,000 pounds, so they're actually on the smaller side. You also may notice he has a pointed upper lid. They kind of use that like a finger. Up ahead, we have one here 
on the left and a couple on the right. These are termite now. These can be found throughout the savannah. Look at the baby. It's a baby rhino. You can see all that mud on his back. Wow. <laughs> Looks like he was rolling around earlier. Here's a couple more cheetahs hanging out back here on the left. Cheetahs. That is cheetahs are more active during the daytime. Zebras. As opposed to the lion or the tiger that are more active. Oh, I got tigers. They'll stay home and protect the prime. Lions rest about 20 hours a day.
Thanks for watching. Subscribe for more videos at J's and K's World.